Welcome back. My name's Jesse. This is Hunt Training. It's been a minute. I don't know how this mic and camera is all going to work out, but today I want to talk about a couple things. We got these little things from 100 Concepts called hex caps right there. You notice on the dot. But the real reason that I reached out and bought it is this thing right here called the light cap. So I haven't shot a whole lot in a while. And, you know, finally my wife is like, hey, you know, you haven't built a rifle. Why don't you build a rifle, a nice rifle? So I built myself a rifle. This is basically a Geisley Super Duty rifle in the grand scheme of things with arrow precision upper and lower, BCM bolt, a couple other BCM things. We got a Surefire out there. And basically what it comes down to is I put a Huxworks brake on there knowing that I plan on suppressing this rifle for the majority of its life once I'm able to get the suppressor picked up but by putting the surefire out here i don't know if you guys can see that on the lens of the surefire the carbon is starting to build up but on top of that the uh the light's getting a little chipped from the muzzle brake and the muzzle brake's obnoxious but i i was like well it doesn't really matter if i'm gonna run it loud i might as well run it loud but at the same time the point was that it's gonna be suppressed so it doesn't matter and so that's why I set it up that way. But anyway, I purchased all these parts from 100 Concepts and hoping that it will help protect that lens and I won't have to move the light because I don't want to move the light. I like where the light is. Yeah, I could move the light. It'd be super simple. But uh, anyway, so this is going to be the first shots with the ruggedized light cap. This is, this is mounted via their shot collar. I believe that's what they call it. And it's just got some shot cords. So hopefully it doesn't break. And you guys are going to see, and it looks like it's going to do its job. And you know, here's the deal. If I ruin a $50 light cap every now and again, it's not that big of a deal. But if I ruin a light head constantly, I'm going to be pretty pissed off. Like I said, this, this light cap is pretty cool. Uh, you can just, you literally just slap it out of the way and push it back on. And, it's just held on by some shot cord, which is pretty cool. Do some more shooting. Also got, like we said, the hex cap there for flare. So, pretty awesome. I'm sure you just got hammered with some recoil. So let's back up a little bit. This 14.5 eats. Really happy with the build. I'll talk more about it. But anyway, this is a short little video for you guys. I wanted to show you the hex caps. I also got one on the P10 there. See how we do here. Oh my goodness. If I could hit my target. Anyway, I mean, this one, I noticed the hex a little more. I don't know why I don't notice it very much in the rifle, but I mean, still, Looks freaking cool, so that counts. And, you know, in the end, if you're looking at your target, none of that matters. Anyway, guys, uh, thanks for stopping by. Thanks for watching. Uh, hope you think this rifle's cool. Maybe we'll talk about it more. If you want me to talk about this rifle a little more, go ahead, you know, put words down there in the box. Check out the description box. And if you want to know what I actually do for a living, link in the description, so. Oh, this rifle's so much fun. We'll see you guys next time.